Well, the governor's official endorsement of Donald Trump has drawn a lot of criticism here in New Jersey. Christy traveled out of state over the weekend to campaign for the GOP frontrunner. He spoke with reporters early today, but as News 12's Katie Kairos reports, he refused to talk about Trump. Katie? Well, the governor held a news conference about the Supreme Court here at the State House, but when he was asked repeatedly about Donald Trump, he didn't want to talk. Governor Christie announced his nomination of Judge David Bauman in a news conference at the State House to talk about Donald Trump. He said he just didn't want to take any unrelated questions. Because I don't want to. Anything else? Anything else on topic? Anything else on topic? Heading into Super Tuesday, polls show Trump leading the GOP field with a wide margin of support. But Christie has seen some growing backlash in New Jersey since he announced his endorsement of the front runner. We thought it was rather disappointing. Uh, we had given the governor better credit than that. The Council on American Islamic Relations says Christie previously worked well with the Muslim community and his support of Trump is casting a shadow on that. But if he loses, then he's got to answer to the Muslims and commu the community that supported him, right, and got to respond to that. Now, how is he, how is he going to do that? That's another issue. Christie himself avoided the issue of Trump on multiple questions. Seriously, you know, you know there's no shot. So either you're putting on a performance for the cameras or not. No chance I'm answering those questions. No chance. Well, neither Christie's office nor the Trump campaign has responded to questions about whether Christie will be campaigning for Donald Trump again soon or when that might be. We're in Trenton. I'm Katie Kairos, News 12, New Jersey.